Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today we're tackling an important question for Android developers. Is the purchase token of Android in-app billing globally unique? Our viewer is curious about the uniqueness of the purchase token, especially since the order ID can sometimes be null during testing. Let's break this down together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're gonna to be going through a question, going through those answers, and hopefully it leads to your solution. Remember, stay a little bit crazy, just like me, to get through to your resolution. Now let's get started. Let's address the question of whether the purchase token in Android in-app billing is globally unique. First, it's important to understand what a purchase token is. According to the Android documentation, the purchase token uniquely identifies a purchase for a specific item and user pair. This means that it is unique within that context. However, the purchase token can be duplicated if the same item is purchased by different users or if different items are purchased by the same user. This is a key point to remember. To identify all testing purchases, you should rely on the purchase token field, as test purchases do not have an order ID. This allows you to track and manage your test transactions effectively. In summary, while the purchase token is unique for a specific item and user, it is not globally unique. Use it wisely to track your purchases, especially during testing. Let's now look at a user suggested answer. Yes, the purchase token in Android in-app billing is globally unique. You can use it safely as a primary key in your database. And that's it guys. We've gone through, answered your question, and hopefully you found that solution you're looking for. Guys, if you did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, you need technical help, I'll see ya. Have a good one.